try to find a project which is similar to the Volvo Ocean Race. You can count them on a few fingers. You start from a zero site and you build everything up. It's a very extreme challenge. These events can't happen without huge logistics infrastructure behind the scenes that really nobody actually ever sees. Part of the battle is trying to get things to run smoothly and having the great relationships. That's enabled the operations to become so much smoother. It's a great team. We enjoy each other's company, but work hard at the same time. We're here in Newport, Rhode Island, uh, USA, on the Volvo Ocean Race and managing the logistics for that as GAC Pindar. We've got to get uh, 94 containers from here to Gothenburg in Sweden. And unfortunately, there's no commercial route which will uh, enable the race's timeline to be met. So all the containers have to go from here onto a barge, onto a ship, and that ship will sail directly from here to Gothenburg, Sweden. We are very creative in the solutions we can come up with. When the Volvo Ocean Race gave us the timeline to be met, we've had to adapt, be flexible, roll with the punches, look at each challenge as it comes up, come up with inventive solutions for the race to meet its timeline. Here we are in Gothenburg. We've got the BBC Mont Blanc, which we saw just over 10 days ago. And very exciting to see it here in Gothenburg, Sweden on time and containers being offloaded as we speak behind us. So we've had Jenny from the GAC uh, ship agency here in Sweden, clearing the ship in, making sure the paperwork's in place. We've got the GAC Pindar on ground team who are then on site receiving the containers and making sure they end up in the right place for the race village to be built on time. GAC is a very special company to work for. Except from the freight forwarding and the shipping business, we lo we're doing a lot of sports logistics, especially in the sailing industry. GAC have a lot of experience in the sailing world. Their hearts in this race, and to date, uh, done very, very well. And uh, Newport to Gothenburg has been a glowing example of this. Our setup is very much about the whole process. So rather than just straight freight forwarding, it's very much about the on-site management as well. Being on the ground here with it is the key to getting it done properly and managing a lot more than just the freight. It's been a massive effort from the whole GAC team uh, across the board, ship agency, on-ground team, customs clearance, everything's been, been done and it's been a real team effort across the board and we're very proud to have delivered stopover number 11 for the Volvo Ocean Race.